Hello everyone, I am Saurabh Bhatnagar from SaurabhBhatnagar.com and in this tutorial you will learn how to decrease your page load time by removing some of your junk files or your trash files from your uh, site from your WordPress history and uh, why I am putting this tutorial in the SEO category because as you would be knowing that uh, the page load time, the speed of the your page load it is also a factor one of the factors in the SEO optimization of your site and Google considers it so so the better it is that uh, your page uh, load time is low then uh, it will help it is not a very massive factor but yes it helps so what you can do is uh, first of all go to your plugins menu and uh, click on add new so there is a plugin which will help you in this and over here you will type wp optimize and this plugin will come up the wp optimize and uh, to save some time i have already installed the plugin so i will go directly into it in my list of installed plugins and over here you will see that uh, there is a option called optimizer so click on it optimizer and here you will see that uh, there are a few options which are already been checked for example clean all post revisions so this is uh, whenever you make a post revision or whenever you do some kind of a changes in your post so wordpress actually uh, saves the previous history and uh, all posts are uh, saved in the in its history so this is actually not important for your site so you can delete it from here and similarly you can remove other non-important things from your site like in removing the spam comments or the unapproved comments and every other thing so now it will depend on the amount of revisions of your site or the number of spam comments so right now in my site there are there are not a lot of post revisions but i have seen sites with uh, more than 1000 post revisions so it actually helps so over here we will click on the process button and uh, over here as you can see that uh, 264 post revisions deleted and every other thing has been deleted so this will help in the page speed time uh, although it will help just by a uh, one tenth of a second but even then it is a huge factor and uh, a 10 second speed load time from here and uh, some seconds load time optimization from there here and there will actually help in the SEO optimization of your site I will actually uh, shoot some more tutorials on page speed time this will be the first part of this tutorial and I will shoot uh, around 7 to 8 more videos uh, briefing you about some more plugins so I will put it as part 1, part 2, part 3 so it will be easier for you to understand and grab all the things so this is the first part and uh, after you have done this so wh what you can do is you can actually delete the plugin so this is completely up to you you can actually delete the plugin and uh, after some time when maybe let's say uh, after around one month or two months you can actually again download the plugin and repeat the process again so this is what you can do so once again thank you for watching the tutorial and uh, you can find some more tutorials in the in my website so if you are watching on youtube so you can go over to swarabhatnagar.com and if you are already on my website then you can find some more tutorials over here and if you like the video then you can share it with your friends whom you will find that it might be useful for them and you can post your comments uh, below so so even i can understand some new things so thank you for watching once again bye bye thank you